attention, pray and listen, hear your father. These lies they told are so familiar, they will haunt you, they will. So shout out to Lil Yo Lissa Hair for sending me this 22 inch body wave wig. And I'll wait to install it and see what it's about. This is Yo Lissa Hair. Look at it, it's already pre plugged. So for my girlies that don't really know nothing about wigs, it's HD lace, you are not gonna find it. Yes, make sure you guys shop with them. It's the pre plug for me. It's the pre plug for me. I'm telling you, it's the pre plug. It's hair, I can't wait. I can't wait. So now we're gonna go. To now we're gonna go to uh the shop. I'm gonna take these braids out again. Thank you, Scrappy and Bella. Thank you, Yolissa, for sending me this hair. I cannot wait to install it in. Um, I'm also gonna be doing a, I'm also going to do a video on how to do wig installs. So for all my girls that's new beginners, stay tuned for that. Like, this is why I say y'all be liking the Amazon wigs, and I'm not coming for the Amazon warriors. I'm gonna be real with y'all. Amazon not hidden, like they really not hidden. Like, I don't know, like they they lace be y'all what is the problem let's tone it down they lace don't be hidden this is your list is hair okay it already comes pre-plucked it already comes bleached so if you're a beginner friendly type of wig and saw girly if you don't really know what you're doing this is something that's quick easy that you can just literally simply pop on so literally like come on now like still stuck on amazon wigs but i'm gonna let y'all have it and this was not expensive like i think on the website it's only what two hundred dollars y'all spend two hundred dollars on amazon wigs it don't the lace be fuck messed up let's be real i mean the knots be hard to bleach meanwhile your is having the same price as amazon yet it's coming pre-plucked and bleached where y'all finding that at come on now let's 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 stop hyping amazon because amazon really on top of that amazon wigs they be super duper like they be thin like, i don't i don't like that let's let's take your listers out look at it, your listers okay bet so we already know it comes from plus this is on top stop stop i don't know who customized this wig Alyssa, listen i don't know who customized this wig but they customized the fuck out my wig like and y'all y'all still shopping on amazon look at this tell me for straight out the package oh my soul i can't make this up this is straight out the package let's stop that's on y'all though i'm gonna let y'all take it Hey y'all, so um, I just made it back home from Target and I took um, I took a shower because I just, I, I felt sticky, icky and I had to pay a couple of bills today. So, yeah. Don't mind my hair, y'all. I'm, I, like I said, I'm literally getting the whole entire wig and stuff. So, we're just gonna ignore, I'm going to ignore my hair. Um, sometimes I like doing face masks. It's very soothing to me to just, you know, sometimes, you know, just do a little face mask here and there. Um, but yeah, I haven't really been on YouTube like that lately. I've been kind of like MIA, but then again, like y'all know, I already know me. Like, I want to be consistent on YouTube. Like 2024, I really want to be way more consistent on YouTube. Like I do, because I used to be so consistent on YouTube, but I swear to life, like life has literally not like cause y'all know I've been on YouTube since six since I was sixteen. I'm twenty three now. That's fucking crazy. You guys that's crazy. Like to think I've been on YouTube since I was sixteen and y'all literally have watched me grow. Like damn that's insane. Like y'all been watching me since I was a sixteen year old, bro. Like that shit's crazy. Like all of you, like and to think that we're all grown as fuck now, like we're all grown as fuck. Like what? We have to pay bills some of us got kids some of y'all are engaged some of y'all are, are, are like getting houses like that shit is crazy and i'm so proud of us like adulting is hard but we're doing it that's crazy like i watched me when i was a kid and y'all was a kid watching me we were kids together and to think that we're all grown now that's insane like that is like fucking crazy like no way i never i don't know why but i've never even said like i never like, said back and like literally 
all of it. Like, and then some of y'all saying, oh, I miss the old you. I mean, I bet you do. I was 16. Like, I'm not the same. Like, you know, like, you grow over time, you know? And I really want to be in my soft girl era. Like, no miss, no drama. Like, you know, I just, I want to be, I want to be in my soft girl era. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm ready to, I'm ready to like tone, tone it down a little bit. So I'm ready. But yeah. I'm literally like I'm 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 ready to be in like my soft girl era and I just wanna like I wanna be a good mom and I'm ready to buy a home and you know get a financial advisor like you know what I'm saying I'm getting older and I, I'm wanting more for myself. You know, the younger me, I was wild, I was crashed out, I was turning up, but like I really wanna tone it down. Like I'm ready to be in my soft girl era, like I really am. Um and then especially with being a business owner and you know, as a business owner and an influencer, I have to set an example for my girl. You know what I'm saying? I have to set an example and I don't want, you know, I don't want the girls to look up to me as, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't even gonna put down no influencer to give my example, but I don't want them to think that, like, I haven't grown or I haven't, you know, you know what I'm saying? I want them to see me and I want them to go back to my little videos and be like, wow, you know what I'm saying? Like, she did, she went through all of this and she's she's making a, a, a better life for her and she's becoming softer. That's how I want to be viewed and that's what, that's what I that's what I want. Why does someone text me a long ass prayer? Like, but yeah, that's, that's just kind of like where I am. Like, I'm ready to be a woman, you know what I'm saying? a woman of God at that because like I said I've been on my spiritual journey with God so you know that's just something that like I but what God got for me that's that's that what God got for me but enough talking I am getting ready to, I'm gonna keep this face mask on for about 20 minutes I'm going to make me something to eat because I've been moving around a lot so I'm gonna go make me something to eat and you know what I'm saying do a couple of work watch some TV I'm gonna come with me we finna make something to eat I'm on a diet because I like it where my weight stand is so um, yeah, but let's go. Now listen, daughter, pay attention, pray and listen, hear your father. His lies they told are so familiar, they will haunt you, they will kill So I just made me um salmon bowl, a salmon salad. Okay, so I just made me a salmon salad uh, with dressing. I might have OD'd on it. I'm gonna come get you one of these. I'm gonna finish eating this and then I gotta do some work. Oh, um, I gotta work. Gotta answer some emails back. A few clients today. So, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm not cooking dinner today. This is my dinner. The air can have some chicken nuggets. I might make him some chicken nuggets and fries. Cause he's not gonna eat this. And then we'll call it a day. But yeah. See y'all in a, a little bit. So this is what I made today for the year. I do not feel like cooking, but he still has to eat. His apple slices, his juice, some chips, and a cookie. No, this sounds like a lazy mother, but <sighs> mommy is just really tired. So I just threw something together. So yeah. did not throw something together, Scrappy. Yeah. So I'm at this boutique that's in Dallas. And yeah, we're gonna try to get something because the mall didn't have nothing at all. Like nothing. So we're gonna try to get something. Dear, don't touch it. Mommy not gonna buy it. Don't touch it. But yeah, I'm gonna try to get something that go with these shoes right here. So but I'm thinking about this dress. This dress is cute. So we're gonna see in there. I'll meet y'all at the shop. You ain't were scared with me, y'all. So I'm just gonna be sitting here working because I got stuff I gotta work on. So I'm just like, I'm just gonna work. It is what it is. So that's what I'm gonna do. I got some stuff that I need to do and plan out, talk about. Um, so I'm like, tomorrow I have, I'm gonna have my shoot or whatever. Can we just have a talk real quick? Okay. I, I know this sound crazy though, right? But like, I, I'm a business owner now, but y'all remember how I used to dream of being like, uh, like doing music. Like y'all remember that, like, I remember there was a time in my life where I was doing music. Some of y'all do know me from when I used to rap, right? Y'all, I low key want to start back doing music again. I low key want to get back in the studio and drop a music video. Like I'm dead ass serious. Like I know y'all probably like, girl, here you go with another 
here you go with another one of your little ideas. I swear to y'all, like, I promise on my soul, like, dead ass, like, this, I'm supposed to be getting some, I'm, so I was gonna invest a whole bunch of money into my inventory, but like, I don't know, maybe this is just me being bipolar, cause bi I am bipolar, y'all, and like, bipolar people, maybe like, having these manic episodes where they just come up with like, all these different ideas, I don't know, I'ma pray about it, but I dead ass wanna do music again, like, I dead ass wanna do music again, like, I like being a business owner, I wanna, I don't know, y'all, I wanna do everything, like, I don't know, I wanna do everything. <laughs> like, I want to be an astronaut. Like, I, but I'm dead ass serious about me doing music again. I'm like so serious. I'm dead ass want to do music again. But I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It's just something I'm talking about. We'll see. These are Budak Samyang noodles. Uh, Fiesta. So I'm about to make some of these and I'll talk to y'all later. Alright, so. Oh, no. You can go ahead and talk. So basically, I'm about to. I think when this time get old, I'm going to do I'm about to get my makeup done. This is Naya. She's an MUA. Actually, I have made a clip, but it ain't gonna go in there. So you might as well just redo it again. This is Naya. She's an MUA. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to get my makeup done. And for this hair, make sure you guys go shop with your Lisa hair. Because, yeah. But I'm gonna see y'all later whenever I got to look together. My makeup is now completed. Yep. So I'm gonna take pictures. And then, yeah. But really, it's going to be the end of the vlog, and I'm going to try to get it uploaded and etc. But yeah, I'm almost done. So yeah. All right. See, see me. Oh, they bought that shit. They bought the biggest one. Shout out to Chris and Naya. They both did the work. If only we had a plastic surgeon here. <laughs> but ponytail nah, but I'm dead serious though like it's a lot of love here so y'all need to go book the look cause they got me right for real a long time no see so much has changed in the last couple of months I think I spoke to y'all so much has changed um, I'm currently moving into my new suite today so I'm excited about that. Um, my business is still going strong. I'm not giving up. Even on the slow days, I'm not giving up. Um, so today I am going to show y'all what it's like a day in my life as a hairstylist, an entrepreneur. Um, I'm going to handle a couple of, like uh, just a couple of things. So for one, gotta get stuff for my new suite. Got a client here to do. Gotta make some flyers. Just several things I gotta do. And then I wanna cook dinner tonight, but I don't know. I might get for fugu. I think it's food. I think so. But today we are where I'm wearing my scrubs to work. I'm wearing my scrubs. Y'all, to all my hairstylists, all my future hairstylists, or my cosmetologists girls, or my estheticians, wear scrubs. It's professional. Wear scrubs. So we're just going to go along today and we're going to, you know, get the day started. You know what I'm saying? Show y'all what it's like. Follow my young girls that want to be a hairstylist or even just oh, anybody. Not even young. Just whoever. To all my girls or to all my guys that want to be a hairstylist or be an entrepreneur or just... You know, whatever it is that you want to do, I hope this video motivates you to continue to keep going. Um, and I hope this video helps you uh, pick up that camera, start vlogging, getting your content bag, getting your bag in general. Whatever it is you want to do, continue to go forth with it, continue to stay motivated, continue to keep God in it. So I'm praying that this video reaches out to you and I'm praying that this video helps you out in the long run. So anyway, let's get started. Yeah. Who did 
your hair. Slave by me, cheap. Period. Period. To Starbucks because there, really, I've never been a coffee person until now. I'm gonna be real with y'all. I've never been a coffee person until now. Let me do this video real quick. We're in our content bag. All um, all 2020. Is it four? Yeah. We're in our con content bag. All 2024. I'm on my way to, uh, okay, so I'm on my way to pick up this salon chair. Ooh, I'm on my way to pick up this salon chair because I need a salon chair for the area that I work at. Um, so I'm going to pick that up. Like, let me turn this on. So yeah, basically I'm going to go pick up, uh, I'm going to go pick up a salon chair, whatever. I know it's some people that, you know, uh, want to be a hairstylist I'm only I'm talking to the people that are I'm a, let me talk to my future entrepreneurs uh, right now this is my slow season I'm not gonna lie this is like me being very transparent this is my slow season okay like this is my slow season because I'm not a braider I mainly do like frontals quick weaves ponytails and it's getting hot out so the braiders the girls are wanting braids and I I don't really know how to do braids so for me this is it's it's kind of getting slow so my advice to all my hairstylists pick up a trade so every hairstyle has got a fast season and a slow season it's whatever you do so since I know that this is my slow season summer is my slow season I'm gonna go take a um, braiding class and I'm gonna learn how to do knotless and boohoo braids and stitch braids so that way I'm not losing out on money and it's always good to pick up another trait it's always good to um, learn something new it'll, it'll it will expand your business and it, it will expand what you can offer to um, your clientele so since I know that this is my slow season I'm about to learn how to do braids I'm gonna take a braiding class I'm not even gonna get discouraged. I'm not even gonna be like, you know, get nervous. You know what I'm saying? Cause I know I know what I signed up for. Um, the winter time I was making buku money. I'm not gonna lie. But right now it's slowing down, and that's just me being real. So instead of me getting nervous, getting scared, that's okay. I'ma keep God first. I'ma continue to pray, and I'ma just pick up another trait in the field that I'm in. That's it. When, my thing is when you got God in your life and when you keeping God when you when you got God leading your way You don't have to worry. I prayed about it. I talked to God about it and this it's in his hands I pray and I work and I stay I stay focused. So it's slow right now for me. That's okay I had a conversation with God and I know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pick up another trade. I'm gonna learn how to braid and, it's, and, and like I said I've been wanting to learn how to actually braid like I know how to braid but it's not good You know what I'm saying? It's not good for me to be uh, taking clientele in and then on top of that also when it's slow you can uh, do content you can do like free work and um, so when I say do free work yes do free work y'all don't even understand my business blew up for me doing free work like I would I would tell girls like oh come come try a free hairstyle I would do like free hairstyles that I'm not comfortable in comfortable with until I got comfortable baby I will post that on TikTok and it blew up on TikTok and it, it, it blew my business up you know what I'm saying so don't don't um don't feel like you too good to do free work even if your business is blown up like I said it's always good to do a content to do trade don't be so money hungry you know what I'm saying don't be so don't be so money hungry like don't 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 be like that um because being money hungry it really it won't get you far i promise you it won't so always be humbled always keep always be like-minded when it comes to your business ain't nothing wrong with doing free work okay ain't nothing wrong with running discounts it's good for your business you know what i'm saying like get the girls hype like what do you got next you know what i'm saying or do raffles you know what i'm saying uh you could do raffles oh if you share my page you enter a raffle get a 150 dollar gift card you know what i'm saying give back be fun be spontaneous don't be you know what i'm saying don't be so stuck up and strict don't nobody like that those stylists never make it far or any business owner that 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 does that never make it too i'll talk to y'all in a little okay so i have made it to the shop um so I'm about to show y'all something. Else. So this is our storage unit, and so I'm about to put all of my products in the storage. And I'm about to show y'all. Well, y'all already y'all already kind of know why. Cause okay, this is all my stuff is in here, but they're in bags. Like I have to get that together. Here's me back in my scrubs, and then here is my salon chair. 
that I have to put together. And so that's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it together. And yeah. But I'm gonna try my best to stay motivated. So I'm gonna try my best to be motivated today. I'm kind of like getting tired again. But it's okay. We'll try. We we'll got We gotta keep going. Um, because I don't get off my ass. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back to dance. Um, that's what I'm gonna do. And yeah, let me see what's on. 39. So I pray that I'm doing by four because I have a client at five. I think I should be done by then. And um, I'll just check back in with y'all. So. <laughs> Thank you.